23 ABC's digital update is brought to you by West Medical. I'm Mike Hart. Here's a look at what we're following on this Friday. Public Health reporting more than 1,100 new cases of COVID in Kern County for a second straight day on Thursday. We'll get new numbers later this morning. According to Public Health, the total number of cases surpassed 12,300 with another 1,135 cases. Some encouraging news, though, is the death toll did not increase, holding at 115. Let's take a look at some of the other numbers of COVID-related Items here in the county, health officials reporting that more than 5,000 residents have now fully recovered. Another 7,000 isolating at home. Officials say more than 96,000 tests or just over 86% have come back negative. And Houchin Community Blood Bank says they need donations of convalescent plasma. Right now, they've only received about 100. Next week, the blood bank's running a campaign where anyone who donates plasma gets a $50 gift card for a free meal in the Bakersfield community. All right, let's take a look at that forecast because things, yes, are heating up. Good morning. Taking a look outside at your forecast. We had a low pressure system really dominating over the central coast for the past couple of days. That's what gave us those cooler temperatures slightly below average. That's no longer the case today. Even though we are at average temperatures today with moderate air quality and AQI of 84. Nice day to get outside at least until noon once we hit that 90 degree mark. We'll warm up quickly after that to 98 degrees our high today by 4 p.m. We'll cool off tonight in the overnight hours. 70 degrees today will be our low after seeing 60s yesterday. Don't expect to see those anytime soon because we'll be seeing those triple digits into effect on Sunday. Tomorrow, still missing those triple digits by a couple of degrees. So some good news, but after that, we will really start to warm up 102 by Sunday. And then look at that triple digits through the rest of next week. Here comes the heat. That's going to do it for now. That's some of the stories that we're following. Don't forget, you can find breaking news, weather and traffic and all your headlines anytime, anywhere on our mobile and tablet apps or our website. Turn to 23.com. We'll have another update for you right here later today.